Whatever my mom told you, it's not that bad. What happened to your eye? Football in the face, sir. Now that students know Adam's a girl, I think he needs to transfer schools immediately. What? Mom, we came to Degrassi so I can start over. I'm not doing it again. Do you know what happens to trans kids in high schools? Enlighten us. Harassment, assault, bullying, or worse, death threats, Grace. Adam. Mom, stop being so dramatic. <sighs> this isn't me. These are the facts. Uh, we understand your concern, Mrs. Torres, but I don't think your son needs to change schools. Really? And the boys who harassed him? Fitz and Owen have been suspended, and we're taking a number of precautions to ensure your son's safety here. Like what? An adult will accompany you from class to class, and you'll have to use a different washroom. Well, I'm not using the girls. You're not. The handicap washroom. Special needs. You've got to be kidding me. Miss Cosmo, civics teacher, LGBT advisor. Can all this just blow over so I can be normal again? Only a matter of time before the next school scandal comes to a boil. Hang in there. My family's pissed. They'll be even more so when I introduce Grandma to her grandson tonight. Surprise! She's never met you as Adam before? And you're not worried about sending her into cardiac arrest? Now I am. You're one brave warrior. Your grandma will accept you in time. Here's hoping. Moving out. Man, I give up on this, though. She's gonna be an old, dried-up digi witch for the rest of her life. You're just mad she didn't fall for your motorcycle blog trick. That's not it. She just thinks because I'm young, I can't relate to her. It's ageism, yo. Just do your work and get by, then. My intellect only gets me so far, Wes. My connection with my teachers is what gets me from a B to an A. Besides, if you can't make her laugh, you make the class laugh. How's that gonna help? It's not. I'm going kamikaze. Time to teach this teacher a lesson. It's a mouthful. Ready? Um non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. Is that like cancer? Yeah. It's weird, though. I mean, she doesn't look sick. My aunt had cancer. She didn't look sick either until she went through the chemo and lost all her hair. And how is she now? She got much better after the chemo, uh, but then she died, like, recently. Anya, it's time to finish Pompeii. Do you have pieces? What, am I interrupting? No, uh, we were just talking and stuff. Um, I gotta go, guys. Bye. Is everything okay? Um, I didn't, I didn't make the stupid village. None of it? The houses, the trees. Wow. Um, I, I'm sorry. I will, uh, I'll come help. You know what, um, uh, I'll handle it. It's okay. Okay. Zap, I think Anya knows that we're together, idiot. You know, on a scale of bad things that could happen to her, this is the worst. So we were at my locker. 
I ripped open his shirt, and he has boobs. He's a girl. Are we gonna do this or what? I'm no lesbian. Neither am I. Look, you need a partner, I need a partner. You need therapy. Touch me again, and I'll kill you. And that number. Are you okay to partner with me? Uh, actually, my uh, ankle's wrecked. I'll set this one up. Sorry, it's up to you. You've all been busy on your blog entries. Oh, Miss O. Yes? Well, when you assigned that blog, I felt caught with my pants down. Why is that, Dave? Well, you know, it was my first blog entry, and your instructions felt rather bare. You talk to me after class. Oh, no, I think I'd really rather discuss it now that I'm feeling, you know, loose and free. Anyone care to share what's funny? Hands back on. What was that? She didn't even yell at you. She didn't even crack a smile. Can I get this shirt for dinner tonight? Ugh. What about, uh, this? I've thought about it. I want to introduce Grims to Adam tonight. Then don't come. What? I don't understand why we can't just have a normal family dinner. I don't deserve this. It's not about you. I know. It's about our whole family. What are you so scared of? I'm scared that you're going to start hurting yourself again. I haven't in a long time. You know, Adam, I don't ask for much. I just wanted to have a nice family dinner. That's all. Let's go. So where'd you get those boxer shorts? <laughs> My cousin knows a guy. It was weird how Miss O was all calm, like she was sad or something. Yeah, she's probably riding on the hog with her boyfriend by now. Yes. <laughs> Oh, your tear ducts are active. She is human. Something must be up. She changed her profile picture. No longer in a relationship. Ouch. So that's why she's sad. She's got a broken heart. I just want to pass. I feel bad for her. <laughs> so, how's the resurrection of Pompeii? I'm great, thanks. Mom? Door number three! Oh. Door number three! Oh. Ah, I told you! What's up, honey? <laughs> um, when you go through treatment, are you gonna lose all your hair? Mm, no, not with radiation. Good. But <clears throat> it still might be scary. I'm gonna be tired, probably feel sick. But she's gonna be okay, right? What, this old soldier? Of course. I'd really like you to be at the doctor's meeting tomorrow. Tell you what, after dinner, why don't we give each other manicures? I can't let the cute doctor see me with nails like this. Look at that. Let's hope he's more focused on your health than your nails. Aw, don't be jealous, honey. Whatever. <laughs> How can you guys be laughing right now? Anya? No, I mean, you just said that she might not be okay and you're acting like nothing's wrong. Aren't you sad? Or... Well, of course, Bumblebee, but we can't stop living. 
Okay, I can't deal with you guys right now. I'm gonna go to school and I'm gonna finish my project. Okay. Anya. You always take me to restaurants with pictures on the menus. Are you trying to tell me something? No, Mom, we just heard the food's good here. Not even a chuckle. Gracie always likes my jokes. Where is she? Um, she said she couldn't make it, but, you know, she had commitments after school. Hey. Gracie, glad you could make it. Yeah, haven't seen you in a while. Pompeii. And of course, you finished it without me. Bye. Come the skin, and I bleed just like anybody. Sometimes doesn't ever bother. You're all about to die, and you don't even know it. and Drew were the best of friends from the day they met. That was taken just after her wedding. Such a beautiful girl. Oh, yeah. What book were you squashing there, Gracie? Actually, I have something to tell Grams. Gracie, please. I, uh... Taking ballroom dancing class. Oh, that's wonderful. I miss you so much. Disaster. We're gonna fail. Is there anything you have to say for yourself? No. I I'm sorry, I just can't believe that you would jeopardize our grades over something so stupid. Excuse me? Come on, Anya, don't you think you're overreacting? Just overreacting. <sighs> Get me out of here. <sighs> leave me alone. Anya! I know we're not supposed to be together, but I didn't think you'd screw up our term. What are you talking about? You ruined the project because Sav and I are together. My mom has cancer. And I can't even look at her without thinking about her dying. Oh. I'm a horrible daughter. <laughs> You're not a horrible daughter. Then why am I here and not at the doctor's appointment? A horrible daughter would not bring your mom's soup the way that you do. You know, soup's not gonna cure cancer all day. But you might regret it later if you're not there for her now.
Belarusian day, and remember, I'm ducking marks for spaghetti arms. Keep that tension alive. You make one ugly girl. Uh, is it uh, Gracie or Tranny? Bianca, principal's office. Sir, if I go one more now. time. If you want to skip evaluation. Um, actually, I was hoping to dance with you. Sure. And uh, it's Gracie. OK, Gracie. I wanted to apologize. I've been really out of line. It's fine, Dave. Don't do it again. If it helps, it gets easier with time. Excuse me? A breakup. A student is not giving me breakup advice. Your motorcycle assignment, it, it hit a nerve. Riding was our thing. <laughs> so I couldn't pick the worst topic to suck up with, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, come on. I made you laugh. So, does this mean I can get a second chance on the blog? Charm doesn't get you grades in my class. Hard work does. I can do that. And did I mention you can do way better than that guy? Enough, Dave. No sucking up. Cool, okay. Gotcha. If I'm Gracie, everything's easier, right? For everyone. When I was her, I used to burn myself. It's how I let the anger out. But you're not her. I have to be her. For my mom, my family, for everyone. I'm trying so hard. You don't have to change who you are. Everyone else does. Here, let me help get you home, OK? Not in these clothes. Come inside, then. I'll find you something. Tonight, fun, I'll wrap up where I was before. Mm. Sorry, I'm late. I'm so glad you came. Mm. Hi. Hi, I'm Dr. Christopoulos. Hey. It's yes. a mouthful, so Dr. Chris is fine. Hi, Hi, Dr. Dr. Chris. Wow, I uh, in unison, okay. <laughs> well, I'm glad you could all come in. It's important that you be there for each other through this. So, lay it on a stock? We caught the cancer in a good time to fight it. <laughs> it's not gonna be easy. You're gonna have to stay strong through this. That's not gonna be a problem. Anya's my rock. She's like an image of me. Not how she looks, how she sees the world. What happened? When you look at me, do you see a boy or a girl? Oh, Adam. Just answer me. A girl. I said bye to Gracie a long time ago, but you haven't. And that sucks. Can you look at me? I'm trying my best. I just don't know if I can say bye to my daughter. The only time I get to see her is when Grams comes in pictures. You made such a pretty girl. But I was never happy. I know. I just don't understand. You don't have to.
Just accept. Accept what? That your life is going to be hard? Mom, it's hardest when I'm Gracie. If I'm going to get through it, I need you to see me as Adam, your son. We have to put Gracie to rest. She's mine. Love me some bonfire. That'd be a good way of saying bye to Gracie that doesn't involve hurting myself. What did your counselor say? We're gonna try really hard to ensure that doesn't happen again. Whoop! You force her to come? Nope. So are we gonna do this? We have some ugly ass close to burn. Not for you. <laughs> Are you sure? Not ready to burn it? Still me.